somebody who will be able to do it. Listen, God empowered me to run through a troop and jump up over a wall. He said, because I didn't run to jump into the position that Samuel, years before, anointed me to do. He said, instead of trying to go to be somebody else's boss, I went and became my daddy's servant. And I went back out in the field with his dirty, stinking sheep. And I watched over his sheep. And God then told me, I'll let you now watch over my people. Now, when you look at the word run, this particular text doesn't mean that David he scattered the people. No, it means he broke them down. It says David went when David came to the battle. Break down, break through his coming. Said because David came in to take what had been taken away. Y'all are here. And some of us, you better get this thing in your heart. You fight tonight. You are too nice when you deal with your opponent. You fight too nice. You got to go in the enemy's camp and you got to take back everything that was taken from you. Some of us, we keep worrying what people going to say, but we go ahead and just that he always came back with their spoils. He took. Ah. Well, I knew some of them songs were not like this. You just want to act like you so nice and you so nice all the time. And then you go up in the house and you mean as a rattlesnake up in your own house. You know, you got this, you got this out in public thing. But when you get home, you make everybody most miserable. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sit down. John says that those who do the leading, you got to lead by good example. He says that this type of leadership that David was getting prepared for, it required courage. And it's the kind of courage that cements the leader to the vision. You got to be cemented to the vision. So they get that's why we talk about stuff that don't even matter in the battle. What does that matter? When that is never the object that you're going after. Your object is your result. Your result is your outcome. Why am I going to talk about something that's happening on Tuesday and I'm living for Friday? Mrs. Brown. 
this year. Nobody else cares. Why do I have to care? All right. Can I just take the approach that everybody else takes? Point the finger at somebody else. Can I take the easy way out? Can I just get in my car and say, oh well. And God says, cultivation brings frustration. If you're being cultivated, you can't let momentary matters frustrate you. So God, I'm being humiliated. That goes totally against my persona. God said, who cares about humiliation when I can blink my eyes? will be the ones that will have to serve you for the rest of your life. He said, focus on what matters. And all that matters now is being cultivated for glory. All that matters now is being cultivated for glory. And I had to get honest with God and say, every sense, you were like a fire in my belly. And you said, go global or go home. My arch enemy has tried his hardest to drive me away. Constant and get cemented to being cultivated. So I just want to talk to the real church today. Some folk trust me. They're not going to let go of the last little bit. shows up whenever you have to get things cultivated. Just that last little bit. What you're saying is the last little bit, Apostle. That last rolling of the eyes. Yes. That last smart remark. Yes. That cuts to the heart. You ever had somebody to talk at you as they're walking away and all you can see is their butt. But you know it's intended to stay. Because they don't tell you in the face. And so they talk at you as they dismiss you from their attention. So they walk away as they talk at you. And that's when you know there's that way it's no bit. That's the part that's going to keep you local and you're going to miss global. And so I just want to talk to the real church today. The real people that know the things that are transpiring in your life, they are common day irritants. Everybody that falls under the unction and the anointing of our Christ, we all experience it. But the thing that separates us is we don't get hung up on other people's hang ups. You gotta stop tripping over trivial matters. What does that have to do? with where you're going. What does that have to do with what your assignment is? Why are you letting them destroy your joy? Why are you letting them taint your anointing? And that's what God is dealing with us now. We're here 
getting into 2013. 13 is said to be the number for rebellion. And so they're looking for a year of rebellious people to literally come forth now and bring so much terror and havoc in orderly places. But the Holy Ghost told me I can change the year any time I get ready. And so for us, it's going to be the year of explosive encounters. So I'm fine. 
find myself trying to take the church that I'm going to follow to work. Go ahead and say it. You don't even want to work in the church, but you get spiritual in the secular. <laughs> can never work unless you witness. I didn't say it, the Bible says it. So I just want to talk to the real church. I want my tomorrow, 2013, I want it to be the year of explosive encounters. I want every day to matter. Every day. We would be liars if we said that we don't need to be cultivated. Yes, we do. Yes. We need to be cultivated. We need to get instructions. We need our cause to be in our heart. So that we won't get caught up in the enemy's traps. We find out we're trying to experiment on one another. Every word ain't for somebody else. Some of it's for us. Yes, yes. God yes. knows. Sometimes if you want to lay your hands on somebody else, lay your hands on yourself. See if it works on you, then try it. Revival. I'm 
Shomata. God, I want my hands to heal people. And I keep on walking. I want my embrace to set people free. And I keep on walking. God, I want to take charge of the atmosphere. On my child. On the train. I want to take charge of the atmosphere of my own house. So many people in denial, God. I want truth to run down like a mighty river. Hey, hey. Yes. God, so many people are con artists now. And they're stealing and they're robbing people of their dreams. God, I want to be a person to teach people about their dreams. I want to be able, God, to press into them. A blessed hope, an expectation, a glorious expectation. Don't let your dream die. Cultivate your dream. Cultivate your gifts. God, so many of us have come out of brokenness that we despise authority because everybody that was ever in authority hurt us all over again. So today, God, we want to be broken so we can be cultivated. God, I want, to, I want my mouth to line up, God. With my mind, I want my mind to be clear so my words can be soft. For a soft answer, it turns away wrath. God, I do not want to be holding people based on conditions. But they got to meet my conditions or else I have no need for them. Today, God, the real church is standing at the altar. God, we're telling you, we want to be cemented, God, for this new move that you're bringing. We want people of different colors, different ethnics, different cultures, God, to be free around us. God, help us to have ministry that goes beyond the barriers of color, race, creed, gender. Help us, God. To help the homeless, to help the homosexual, to help the addicted, to help the liar, to help the thieves. Help us, God, to be a help. Help us, God. In the name of Jesus. Don't let us be a sanctimonious, self-righteous people. God, let us be more concerned about living for dying than living for getting. God, help us today. We need you today. So we empty ourselves one by one. Person by person, house by house, leader by leader, we empty ourselves. Anything that I do, teach me all over again. Teach me how to serve your people. Teach me how to pray. Teach me how to preach. Teach me how to usher. Teach me how to have a sound for the, for the atmosphere that's in the room to make it conducive for the people's ears, to touch the people's ears as it touches their hearts. Stop me all over again, God. Get me ready. Teach me how to clean the church. Teach me how to serve in the church. Teach me, God. Teach me how to handle your people. Touch your people. Love your people. Hug your people. Groom your people. Correct your people. Instruct your people. Discipline your people. Teach me, God. Teach me. Teach me how to serve. Teach me how to love my parents. Teach me how to love one another. Teach me how to love my husband. Teach me how to love my wife. Teach me how to love my mother. Teach me how to love my mom. Teach me, God. Teach me how to love my sisters. Teach me how to love my brothers. Teach me, God. Teach me. Teach me, God. Teach me. Teach me as though I know nothing. Teach me as though nothing that I've ever known did I ever comprehend, did I ever understand. Start me all over again, God. Teach me, God. Teach me. So that you might fill the atmosphere with your presence and your power. Teach me how to sing melodies to you. Teach me how to sing out of gratitude. Teach me, God, not to be popular. Teach me not to even have an ear for popularity. Teach me, God, to be humble. Teach me, God. Teach me, God, that those who are humble, God, for a haughty spirit, God, you despise and you will bring it down. Teach me, God. Teach me that all promotion comes from you. Teach me, God. Teach me, God. Teach me that there's a blessing in serving. There's a blessing, God. Teach me. Teach
teach me, God, to labor, to labor, God, to labor until I've heard that I've heard that I've heard. Teach me, God, teach me, teach me, teach me. Teach me, God, not to be quick, God. God, teach me, teach me, teach me, teach me, God. Teach me, God, that the prophetic brings so many responsibilities. Teach me, God, that the first principle is the principle to be responsible. God, teach me to be responsible for my anointing. God, teach me today. Teach me. Teach me, God. Teach me. Teach me, God. No, 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 Come on, those of you who talk to him. Come on, no, 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 These are words that I cannot speak, I cannot call. Come on, talk to him, talk to him. Come on, you don't have to worry about nobody listening because they can't interpret what you're saying. Come on, 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 come on,